Hey there, wrestling fans. It's your all good buddy here. The one, the only, Team Rara, and back with another wrestling video. Now, my latest wrestling related kind of thing is was my 2015 Money in a Bank review. The audio version. Now, if you want to check it out, be my guest. If you don't, I'm not gonna worry about it. I'm not forcing anyone to watch it, okay? Or listen to it. But in my eyes, it was a okay pay-per-view. Now, this one, in this video, it will be the first and many preview matches for the upcoming pay-per-view called Battleground. What a name for that. Whatever. But this match was officially announced last night at the Money in the Bank pay-per-view. Um, I just want to tell you how this match took place. How this all got started. Um, in the latter match, you know, the briefcase, you know, for the contract. And Roman Reigns had dominated this whole thing. A lot of people thought it was going to be Kofi Kingston. Eh, wrong. I mean, that'd be great, but on the other hand, not so great. Maybe as a face, but, you know, but the one reason it did not happen, it failed, okay? But a lot of my friends, like Stephen Breach and Pico, thought um, Kobe is going to win his very first Money Bank. Not going to happen my viewers. It did not happen. Thank God. Um, whatever. I like Kofi, but I'm going to observe the here. So, uh, Roman Reigns dominate every guy. He had a chance. He was this freaking close, my viewers. And guess what happened? The lights went out. And guess who screwed him out of the um, Money Bank um, briefcase? It was... Bray Wyatt. Really? Are you freaking serious? I mean, don't get me wrong. I love Bray Wyatt. I love his gimmick. I love the Wyatt family before they broke up. And here is the photo from last night's um, epic match. Okay? I don't know if you can see it very clearly. I can't zoom in on this camera. Maybe my neck in the camera. But I got, got a, I got a feeling that when Bray Wyatt screwed um, Roman Reigns out of the briefcase. I had a feeling they're gonna have a match at Battleground. Now it's official. I love how they announce these matches before Raw. I love it. You might have a different opinion. Um, now Bray Wyatt, he's on a losing streak lately. That sucks. I thought he'd be like the top heel. You know, he lost at WrestleMania. Of course, who's gonna lose to the Undertaker? Duh. Um, of course, those not beat them, but that's a different story. Um, I don't know what he's thinking with his character, you know? One day, he wins on Raw or SmackDown or Pay-View, like, it's like hit and miss. And I don't think they know what the hell they're doing. Or maybe they, they think about Bray Wyatt says, you know what, we don't have nothing for him, so let's just push him back to the mid quarter. I mean, in my eyes, of course, we won't do that, but... He, he like a, um, a meat cleaver thing, uh, look like he's gonna kill someone. It just feel weird. He just, he just tip over the ladder and the Roman Reigns fell and... I know Roman Reigns is very, very pissed off. He got screwed at WrestleMania 31 when the, um, Seth Rollins cashed in on him. And he really thought if he got the briefcase, he could do that for his former friend. He's former member of of the shield back in the day. You know, they always say payback's a bitch. Well, it's never happened. Um, I don't know if this is going to be a good match or it's going to be a boring match. We just got to find out around, what, July 28th? I don't know when it is. Um, better problems. I just hopefully it would be enough time. So, um, this is... I don't know what else to tell you. I just hopefully it's going to be a good match. That's all I'm going to say. I'm not a big fan of 
Rollins at all, you know. They shove Rollins down our freaking throat ever since the beginning of this year. He's in a title pitcher, he's not a title pitcher, he's a title pitcher, not a title pitcher, now he's not. Probably next month, he will be in a title pitcher somehow, some form. That'll be like a triple threat match between Seth Rollins, um, Brock Lesnar, and himself, or whatever, you know. I don't give a damn, you know. I just want to see some good wrestling, some good entertainment, and all that hoopla. So, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, this will be it for the preview video. I will do more of these, like I said, in the beginning of the video. Let me know if you like this. If you don't, then I will still... I might end it. I just have nothing to discuss right now. But I don't know if anyone is really looking forward to this Bray Wyatt versus Ron Reigns at the um, Battlegrounds. I don't like the name Battlegrounds, but I wish they went back to the name like um, um, Backlash, you know, that old school name. But that's in the past, this is the present. So I'm going to end this on a high note. I'm going to wrap this sucker up. You guys could follow me on Twitter, it's TeamRI32. And you could hit the seven, you know, it's Team RI, or look on the search bar on um, YouTube or whatever. So, all the wrestling fans who love wrestling, you know, especially WWE, enjoy Raw tonight. And I'll try to do another video tonight if anything big happens. Catch you later.